Ready for a captivating bedtime story to relax and inspire you before heading off to sleep? Close your eyes and let your imagination run wild as we transport you to a world where anything is possible. The Sinister Circus The wind howled through the empty streets, the only sound in the darkness. The moon shone down on the cobblestones, casting long shadows on the walls of the buildings. A chill ran down the spine of anyone who dared venture out into the night. The town had become a place of fear, with whispers of a killer on the loose. The first victim was found in the old abandoned mansion on the outskirts of town. The body was mutilated beyond recognition, with strange symbols carved into the flesh. The police were stumped, unable to find any leads. The town was in a panic, with people locking their doors and windows at night. As the days passed, more bodies turned up, each one more grotesque than the last. The killer seemed to be taunting the police, leaving clues that only led to dead ends. The people of the town were gripped with terror, wondering who would be the next victim. The investigation led the police to the circus that had come to town. It was a strange and eerie place, with performers that seemed to be out of a nightmare. The ringleader, a man with a twisted grin, denied any involvement in the murders. But something about him was off, and the detectives couldn't shake the feeling that he was hiding something. One night, the police received an anonymous tip about the killer's whereabouts. They rushed to the circus, only to find it empty. As they searched the tents, they heard a strange music coming from the big top. The tune was haunting, and seemed to be leading them deeper into the tent. As they approached the center ring, they saw a figure standing in the shadows. It was the ringleader, holding a knife. He began to dance, the blade glinting in the moonlight. The detectives were mesmerized by his movements, unable to move as he approached them. And then, in a flurry of motion, the ringleader attacked. The detectives fought back, but it was too late. The killer had claimed his final victims, his twisted grin the last thing they saw. As the sun rose over the town, the people emerged from their homes, looking at the empty circus in horror. The ringleader was nowhere to be found, his crimes shrouded in mystery. The town would never forget the horrors that had taken place within their borders, and the circus would forever be known as the site of the most chilling and surreal murder mystery in their history. And that's the end of tonight's story. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. We share a new story every night, so be sure to check back for tomorrow's bedtime adventure.